up guys welcome to a new video today we have a sim module uh, Volvo V40 2018 uh, I'm gonna do today uh, copy key customer has one key just need to make another one uh, so for this model uh, if uh, if it, either if it's a copy key or lost key you need to remove the sim module and read the password from it and then you can learn the key it's basically three seconds to read that it's taking long time to remove it um, it's a bit complicated because the location of this it's on the uh, driver side um, uh, under the um, under the like on the steering wheel let's say on the right side of the um, uh, of the pedals and you don't have so much access there there is also the airbag there so it's a bit hard to remove it but uh, it's not impossible and let's start uh, making the process I'm gonna use the ACDP for uh, reading the password let's just open the shell the, the plastic the cover okay There is one more holder here. Perfect, there it is. That's the that's the board. Okay, let's follow the instructions on uh, on the ACDP. I'll try to focus on it. Uh, okay, so let's go on uh, Volvo. Where it is? Where it is? Right here, Volvo. Emo, and then let's go on V90 2016. Oh, touch my mistake. Let's go back. Okay, V90 2016-2021. Okay, and read SEM data by ICP. Um, it also show us where the SEM is located. Uh, I think this is like a European car on the left-hand drive, but in my uh, in my case here, there is a right-hand drive on the UK. Okay, let's go on the red, uh, read same password. Okay, and let's see which, uh, we, what chip we have here. And there is a SPC. Where it is, where it is. can't see very well on it just the chip here but it has a lock on it so I can't see very well I need to focus on it BCM MG6 okay uh, you can also if you can't find if you can't see uh, what's on it you can just uh, open the um, uh, go to help yeah and it's gonna show you exactly w what chip it is and how the board looks like uh, and as I see, it's not this one. Okay, let's check the next model. Okay, you can barely see here, it's a SM MJ6 on 78s Yes, so that's the right chip. Okay, so it's the second option. It will show everything, how to connect the wires and everything. Uh, just a small adapter. No soldering wires, no nothing. Uh, it's a zero risk to damage the, the SEM module. Okay, so 
let's start working on it. All right, we have a screw here. We have to put a screw on this hole. Alright, next picture. It shows us exactly where the pins it should touch. Yeah, so it's on this position. <clears throat> Here is the board. Um, so we must touch some of these pins here. Okay. Let's zoom a little bit on the picture. Next picture, so it should come just like this. By the way, just in case, right here, uh, it's the connector of the SIM, and on this position, right here, uh, we have a missing pin here, but sometimes uh, that pin it's present on this position so don't be scared about that you can use the adapter either if the pin is right here so this shouldn't be an issue okay let's connect it I need one more screw to hold the adapter just make sure all the pins are making a good connection If you see any pin is not touching the right position, then you can use a tweezer and uh, just um, move easier the the pins. Okay, we need the cable to connect the ACDP. All right, let's go back. And let's follow the the steps forgot to connect the cable okay. it's all good. okay let's follow the process um, where it is XC XC 9 uh, sorry V90 V90 2016 2021 all right Bobby detect read a uh, password okay as I said it's a risk because um, it always checking this adapter is checking always if the pins they are making a good touch so there is no risk to read the wrong password I don't know whatever uh, okay chip pin connecting has been detected perfect all pins they are green so that's fine if one of the pin is red that means it's not touching uh, it's not touching correct the board so let's press ok and it's just three seconds to read the password
All right, pastor has been written. Okay, now we have to save it. All right, just take a picture of this, just in case if you want to find it like, um, in your tablet or on your phone. Okay, that's good. Perfect. And all you have to do now is just to uh, install the sim back on the car and just press killer and that's it um, I will show you also how to do that all right so here is a sim located on the right side yeah just on the pillar right here uh, it's a bit hard to remove it uh, there is no enough space there but as I said it's not impossible I will feed this one back and um, I will also show you how to how to learn the key all right here is the car as I said, I have a working key. So let's learn the new key. We go to, I'm not sure if you can see here. So dark, so it's V, uh, V90. Uh, back a little bit, V90 right here. Make sure you have a good internet connection. And then it's, um, we're gonna press add key. We have to load the same data. Unable to connect the device. Let's try to reconnect the device just for a second. Okay. Let's open the app again. Okay. Uh, Volvo. Emo V uh, V90. Okay, uh, it's uh, where it is. Add key, a load same data. We got a picture right here with the with the same data. It's ending with 748G. It says turn on the ignition. Come on. Done. The, key, the car is ready. Ignition active. Press OK. It just read the V number. Current key is number three keys. Select the same data, and it's seven five seven eight four eight G. Okay. Uh, where it is? It's the last one. It's five oh six two two five oh six one five seven one five seven so it's the last one and okay it says put the key uh, on the emergency antenna which is located right here okay let's press okay yeah current number of keys four continue to add a key no because we already finished adding complete and that was all now the key should perfectly work Let's take off the ignition and let's check the key. Can't see anything in the dashboard, but I can hear that the car is locking and unlocking. And let's also try to start the engine. Yep, yeah, ignition on and everything is done. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you need any help or something like that, I'm trying to answer as much as I can to all the all your comments and all your questions. And if you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It's uh, helpful to it's helping me to to post more videos. Thank you so much, guys.